Hello friends, my name is Dr. Anush Thapliyal and today in the uh, series of videos I will train you on data science using Python. But before getting ready uh, for lab, just have a look what analytics is, analytics is and why we should go for analytics. So analytics is the scientific process of deriving a meaningful conclusion from the raw data analysis. It offers data insights to help businesses make smarter decisions. So what we do first, we collect the data. We have pool of data nowadays. We are in information age right now. And from that pool of data, we do analytics. And uh, finally, after doing analytics, we get insights from that analytics. And on the basis of that, we do or we make business decisions. So all the organization all over the globe, they all are using analytics. Why this data science program? The 2.7 million career opportunities estimated by IBM for, by 2020. Okay, 11 lakh is the average salary in analytics and data science from India today. Data scientist, the sexiest job of the 21st century, Harvard Business Review. And I uh, request all of to all of you that please go through this review, this article. Okay, this is a very beautiful article about data science. 2.5 quintillion bytes of data created every day. Again, the report by IBM. And if I convert this 2.5 quintillion bytes into terabytes, it will be around 25 lakh terabytes. So we are producing this huge data each day. So now the need is to get the relevant chunk out of this big pool of data and do analytics on that. Then India's demand for data scientists grow over 400%. Now see why we are data scientists. So this is the review from Harvard Business Review. This is the article. You can go through it. 11 lakh is the average salary in analytics and data science from India today. And the data I have taken from the Glassdoor company, you can also Google Google it that you can write the salaries, uh, data science salary. Okay. And I have uh, given a link over here as well. You can go through the link as well. And you can see how much each company is uh, providing salaries to data scientists. So like Mu Sigma, 5,56,000, IBM, 14,79,000, TCS, 6,26,000. Okay, Accenture, Futura, Infosys, Wipro. So there are lots of company, companies, uh, th those who are providing huge salaries. Now uh, we do analytics with the help of a tool. So you can choose any of the tool, but my uh, uh, preference and what I suggest that you go for Python and R. For data visualization, you can go for W as well. Okay, now W uh, taken by, uh, by Salesforce. Then we have SAS as well. So we have n number of analytical tools. You can choose anyone, but my suggestion is R and Python. Okay. So what will be our training methodology? So in for data science, statistics is very important. So I will start with statistics as well. Okay, we'll discuss uh, from the grassroots level like mean, median, mode and uh, how to use them and uh, we'll discuss the statistics part as well. Then data science with Python. Firstly, we will learn the basics of Python and once we are done with all these things, then we will go for data visualization. So, uh, if we have to work on Python, my suggestion is that we should go for Anaconda and we, you can install Anaconda and you can type on your browser www.anaconda.com. Okay, so here from here we are getting ready for the lab. Once you will write anaconda.com, this will be the web page. Now you have to download, free download you can download anaconda setup from here anaconda this is uh, anaconda cloud is where packages notebooks and environments are saved or stored 
it provides a, a powerful collaboration and packages uh, management for open source and private projects okay so anaconda is a file distribution system basically so it will be uh, ease of use for all of us if we go through anaconda so download anaconda from here so once it is downloaded okay here downloads double click on it and install it so when you will be uh, when you will be installing this at that time so let us see if i go to next i agree now here you have to select all users okay so select all users and then follow the wizard i have already uh, installed anaconda in my system so that is why i'm not going the further process further steps you can go through and install follow the wizard next next and install it so once you have installed it go to your start menu and from here you can type anaconda navigator so when you will type anaconda navigator this is how you will see the interface so this is the user interface anaconda navigator you have to go to at the right hand side you will go to connect anaconda cloud i am already signed i am sign in already connected to the cloud but you have to sign in from here you can use your gmail id from here for signing up signing the process after that once you are done and you can see this connected to cloud when you are connected to cloud then we will work on jupiter notebook this is a web based interactive computing notebook environment we can edit and run human readable docs while describing the data analysis so from the next video we will learn how to use jupiter notebook but before that please go through this video and install anaconda navigator in your system